Hello friends, welcome to UIDSTML. Today in this video, I'm going to uh, compare two objects. So myself, Gautam Kaur, welcomes you all in this video. And this question has been raised by my friend Rahmat. So let's begin with this, uh, this video. We have uh, we have some HTML, we have HTML and this is just a bare bone structure where to uh, to highlight this H2 here. Although I will be uh, taking advantage of this console, so all the code will come inside this script. So let's create two objects where we are going to uh, compare that those two. Uh, we have two objects. Uh, one is object one and object two. Name channel is started. Name channel is the proper are the properties of object one and object two plus respectively. We'll compare these two objects. So for comparison, uh, comparison, uh, we'll have we will need one function. Let's create a custom function. Uh, function is equal is equal, and it will uh, take two argument, uh, argument A, uh, argument A, and argument B. So uh, we will pass and now call this function. Uh, is equal is equal and pass your object into this one control C and control V object 2 and object <coughs> object 1 and object 2 okay so this is how we have created an object function and we have we have called this function so what uh, I will do now I will uh, take an advantage of objects function that is get uh, on property names and will uh, store those uh, property into an variable and this will return an array of property names let's begin with that one where property one is equal to object dot get property names and will pass a into a here similarly for b Similarly for B. Let's see what we get in these uh, two variables. Console.log console.log and uh, put property 1 and property 2 and save it. See what we get. We get the array of property names, right? Name channel started, name channel started, name and channel. So let's compare these two arrays. If the arrays are not equal in length, then objects are not equal. So put one condition here. If if property one dot length doesn't equal to property two dot length, then return false. If you are returning something from here, then you will have to console here. This console this function as well, so that you then only you will get result in in this console. Console dot log is equal and same wrap it into console dot log. Now, if you will save it, you will get false because the length are lengths are different. Otherwise, otherwise else. return true most of the person writes uh, like this it doesn't require to write it doesn't need to write this else because all if person return if uh, if function returns from here then obviously it will not reach to the next line so this else is not required so give return true here okay now if if the objects have same uh, if ob the property array has same length then Let's remove this. Start it. It will give true, but although these two has different values, so let's compare with the values now. So come here, uh, come to this line and iterate through the property uh, array one, where i is equal to zero, i less than property array one dot length i plus plus now store this property name 
uh, that you will get from the ith position into a variable so it will become easy to uh, compare easy in comparisons comparison so prop name is equal to i will t i will get the property name from array 1 and the property name will have all the properties that we got into this array now compare compare the value of this object okay if if object a property object a property name doesn't equal to object b property name doesn't equal to object b property name if the property uh, sorry if the value of property a is not equal to value of property b then obviously the objects are not equal then return false and see it is false because uh, uh, name is name value is different uh, sorry uh, channel is channel value is different in these two objects let's make it equal copy and paste now save it see it is true so we have compared these two objects it doesn't matter if you place this name somewhere else so below this angular eight it will behave in a similar way so by this way you can you know you came to know how you can compare your objects so kindly subscribe this channel and hit the bell icon so that you can get your the latest videos and you will not miss any videos so till then good night and thank you so much bye bye